Now, on today's show, we're looking at inbound marketing, how to build a brand whilst creating trust and loyalty. And my guest on today's show is Steve Mills. He is the prudent marketeer. How do you improve the performance? If you're going to do this, you're going to invest time, money and effort. We really want to make sure we get the maximum return on investment from that. I think one of the big changes in marketing is, is being the, the change from being very sales focused. This idea of inbound marketing where you, you get people to opt in to your information and you do that through education. I'd say list, list building is, is one of the keys to inbound marketing. Uh, uh, what what we I believe we need to do is to start to try to uh, engage with people, to educate people, to build those relationships. I've been saying for years, marketing is about getting people to know you, like you, and trust you. I, I see one of the biggest failures in marketing is actually what I call FTIing. F F F F F right FTI, failing F to implement. <laughs> <laughs> Simple as that, Steve, you know. Just do but, it. Yeah, just do it. So this, this is a five-step process. This is about developing your crowd, the number of people that you've got on your database or that visit your uh, website. From there, what we've got to do is start to convert them. I call it going for a coffee. You know, that's what we literally need to do, you know, to develop that relationship. From there, you've got to get your first date, in other words, your first sale. <laughs> We've got to start to convert this database and this, uh, this relationship into, into a sale. The next step is about turning that into real cash. And lastly, it's about continuity getting people to buy from you again and again and again. Will you marry me? Yeah, will you marry me? Yeah. Satisfied customers are not good enough. What you need is raving fans, people who will buy from you, they would never go anywhere else, they recommend you to all the people that they know, and they're absolute advocates of you and your business. I think the key is, is to focus on all five. I get asked so often, I get asked this question, what is the one thing I should do, Steve? Well, there isn't a one thing. No, there's never a one thing. There's only multiple things. I said the one thing is many things. You know, you, you cannot, one of anything, I think, Steve, is really dangerous in marketing. You know, if you've got one approach, you, you, you put all your effort into search engine optimization and Google changes its algorithm. 80% of your business disappears overnight. How do we improve the, the, the way we capture information? And you've just shown one great way. Uh, having something that you can give for free on the home page of your website. But I, I think, again, it's about the multiple step approach. I, I have a saying that I've said for many years. In marketing, you've got to be outstanding by standing out. So the key is doing something different. Uh, I love the saying that Walt Disney once said, apparently, if you want to be successful, uh, look what the masses are doing and then do the opposite. And I think that is so true. A very good friend of mine, Peter Thompson, says that you should keep on following up until they die or buy. If your conversion rate is 40% right now, so you get 100 inquiries and you convert 40 of them, if you could improve that, by just 20% to go from 40% to 60%. What that actually means is a 50% growth in your business without spending a penny on marketing. My name's Steve Mills, I'm the Prudent Marketer. I help businesses to market themselves more prudently. I really hope that you take uh, note and action based on those five key principles, the five C's. If you do, you're going to grow your business. If you need help with this, I'm just putting together a five month process based on the five C's. So if you want to know more, you can go to my website, which is theprudentmarketer.com, or you can call me on 01256 345 556. And I'd be more than happy to have a no obligation conversation about how I might be able to help you to go exponential. Thanks very much for listening.